Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough! Let's start! 1-3 Mysterious Powers. Looks like we are finally catching up with the bunny that we don't know about yet. Well, I should say I know about it, but you don't know about it unless you've played this game before. Ah! Look out, Star! It's Big Squiddy! Hey you guys, over here! Help! Help! Hurry up and stay him before he gets the big squeeze! Oh, let's get him. Yeah. Wait, what? What the? The mysterious visitor was in trouble. Star, if you want to help him. And I've got some slight emulation <laughs> glitchy errors with that light effect at the top there. I assure you that there's no flickering line in the middle of the screen there on the on the real deal game there. It's just a slight emulation issue. Anyway, the mysterious visitor was in trouble. Star, if you want to help him. But what's this? You transformed into some kind of monster, Starf? What's going on here? Did the strange little guy make this happen? Roar! Use your spicy belly ability to belch out scorching flames. Roar! And this ability is very, very broken with wherever ability you are, I mean, wherever place you are at. And all you have to do is attack the suction cup, the tips of the, oops, of the tentacles there of Big Squiddy and you will be good to go. This is extremely easy, although I'm, I would like to get in the center of the of the playfield if at all pop. Dang it! <laughs> I just want to get in the center, but I guess this is fine if you want to do it that way. Because sometimes he moves his Squiddy hand off to the side, I mean from the side of the screen, it can be difficult to react to it if you're on the edge of the screen, but I guess it doesn't really matter anyway. That was the ability known as Monstar. I mean that transformation there. That was so scary. What just happened? You two all right? Whatever you did, you sure clobbered Big Squirty. I want to help, but my shell got caught on some seaweed. <laughs> so, what's the deal, kid? Where'd you come from? How'd you end up crashing through Puffed Up Palace? Puffed Up Palace? How did I get to Puffed Up Palace? What's the matter? Did you get the memory squeeze out of you? You really don't remember? I don't remember. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop. He's got amnesia. He doesn't remember nothing. Nada. Zilch. Zip. Huh? Oh, yeah. That shiny, shiny crystal shard thingy. This belongs to you, right? This jog your memory at all? Ring any bells? Shiny crystal shard? There's something about that I remember. Remember! Flashback. Well, kind of. <gasps> Exclamation point. Huh? Where? Oh, uh, my head hurts. Now, a flashback. Intense eyes. Over there. I see his ears. And he falls into some hole, presses a button, something shakes. Hmm. It's, he must have fallen in a ship. And he's gone. Damn you fools! Bring Bunston to me! Flashback is over. Oh, what happened? Oh, my head hurts whenever I remember something. Boy, that big squiddy must have done some squeeze job on your head. Ah! Ah, what is it? Is big squiddy back? Don't come near me. You stay back. What's the matter with you? I think you hit your noggin on one too many rooftops, kid. <laughs> must be bad guys too! You're trying to trick me by pretending you want help! Hey, relax! We just wanted to give this back to you! Ah! Don't come near me! I have to run away! Run away! Get back here! No, fine, I'll chase after you. Now what? He thinks we're the bad guys? He didn't even take his crystal! 
Oh, all right. Let's follow him. All right, let's do so. And we got this game has really nice backgrounds, by the way. Look at the floating bolts in there, and it, it, it's got the pan panoramic setting and whatnot. Can I try demonstrating this to the crowd now, Globerto? Ah, stop you. So good to see you, my good man. How go was your grand adventure? Would you want to return to the map? Yes, I would, because I just want to show the peeps this. All right, well then, I'll send you back now. I will probably never use this throughout the entire walkthrough. <laughs> Except just to show you how this is like. See, now there's a Globerto icon on the, the level there. You can go to other levels, but you can come back here uh, using that checkpoint just by clicking on Ye Ola level. And we are back. And that's how it works. Let's save our game and go through here. Woo! What? What? There's, there's a save point there. And a save point... Three seconds away. What's the point of that? What? How did? <laughs> Forget it. Game logic. <laughs> I'm better off not questioning it. All right, let's see what's down through here because Mo's sniffer is going off like crazy. Exclamation points means that there is a side quest door to be found in an area, but sometimes keyword sometimes there are. Uh, side quest doors hidden on side routes that are hidden by, via other doors. So you won't always be able to use Mo Sniffer to find which screens, I should say which areas, have hidden doors and stuff like that. So sometimes they're going to make you work for that. Anyway, the door that I'm looking... I mean, the, ah, I'm spinning too fast again. <laughs> the place that I'm looking for is through here. And woo! You can jump through the water by using some upward momentum to jump through it like that. And I did a very bad job getting those pearls all in one swoop. That's okay. I'm just going to go through this door and see what side quest awaits me here. All right, Herman, ready for our big race? Hope you've been training, crab meat. Uh, hey, Fork. No, I'm still, um, healing, yeah. I hurt my claw, training for the race. Bummer. Starfy here can do it. Please. Uh, <clears throat> if Fork is always trying to prove he's the best at everything. Whoever reaches that flag over there first is the winner. Will you race Fork for me, Starfy? Sure, I can beat him. That sounds like a worthy cause to, you know, not go chase after the bunny, but go race this fish. Ha! You gonna race me? You don't even have fins! Fork rocks! Kind of reminds me of let that O'Doyle rules family in that uh, one Adam Sandler movie. I can't think of the name right now for some reason. Oh, and that's the end of the race. It's already done, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, old, uh, oh, I can't think of the name of the movie. It's the one where he goes back to school and all the O'Doyle family is bullies in school ah oh, whatever Arr, you beat me I don't believe it you must have cheated or are you really that fast you must know about the secret training gun right fork still rocks and secret 2 gets added to your map yeah these uh, side quest areas unlock uh, secret areas and they're usually obvious which levels relate to which level um, which areas um, just for the fun of it I'm gonna show you uh, what happens if you take the other routes uh, when facing off against this ridiculously slow fish here? So, yeah, if you were to go, like, up there, you would end up trapped. If you were to go down through here, you would end up taking too much time. And, yeah, all the other routes are basically there just to slow you down. And that he basically needs all the help he can get because otherwise you're going to really cream him regardless i mean if you just go right down the center like that like what i did there because he even gets tired part way through the race and yeah i'm not going to whoops uh, yeah you already seen me beat him once with ease i'm pretty sure you know i can beat him again if i actually try <laughs> so let's just go through this door here and continue on the game oh what's with this music franticness ah, it's big squiddy attack attack attack, 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 attack. If you attack his tentacle suction cups enough times, he'll be stunned so much he won't be able to recover from that. Otherwise, you can just run away from him like so. Wait, is he already stunned? Yep, he's done. <laughs> Poor big squiddy. As big as he is, he's not really the toughest of, ad <clears throat> of adversaries. Anything behind me here? No, okay. Let's move on then. And collect some pearls. Ooh, Mo Sniffer is going off. 
That means there's something to be found around this area. Where it is? I don't. Wait, 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 wait. I was gonna say I don't know, but there's a secret over here. Keep breaking through. Is this just for pearls? I think it's just for pearls. Yeah. I will find all the treasure chests if it's the last thing I do. <laughs> And I should probably hold back on the crazy here. Oh, I spun too fast again. That caused me to take a hit. <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. Uh, do I? Uh, I'm always scared to go through currents because when you go through currents, you can't go back at this moment in time. Okay, it's just for some pearls. What's this way? It's a seaweed. Some more pearls. Ah, I get used to the timing. Really, you've got to get used to the timing of this. <laughs> Just relax the spins, watch the animation. Yeah, I see that treasure chest. I see it, don't worry. And there it is. If you want, you can take that current back. But, uh, uh, yeah, I'm not going to... Well, I guess I could, just for the heck of it, to touch every route, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why they have that route there when it's clearly faster to take that route through there. You know, even with the seaweed balls of sorts, I really don't understand that myself. By the way, the levels in this game are really long, except for the really early game levels, so some le I mean, some parts will probably only have, uh, have me cover one level, uh, but that's just the nature of the game, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Out of my way, guys! Ah, You are now fish food. And going back down, going back down, there's something how wide can I make this? Just two squares? Okay, just wanted to see that for the fun of it, I suppose. I guess it's not all that much fun, but, you know, in, in terms of uh, expressions. What do you have to say about my progress? Ah, Starfy. Good, so good to see you, my good man. How goes your grand adventure? Want to return to map? No, thank you. I already showed the peeps how to use you. I just wanted to show the dialogue. Alright, big squiddy. You versus me, one more time. You're going down. Oh, oh. Wait, and oh, by the way, if you get caught, you'll have to shake free with the D pad like that. Like, I'll do that one more time. See that? Yeah, it's it's no big deal. It just really wastes time more than anything. <laughs> and he's already stunned, so I can pretty much leisurely go through this area now without any worries of Big Squiddy, even though Big Squiddy was never really much of a worry to begin with, and through this door we go. Woo. Hey Mo, how's it going? Where'd that big-eared space cadet run off to now? This kid sh isn't making things e isn't making this easy. Sheesh, let's sniff around a bit. Yes, let's sniff around. Isn't there a treasure? Yeah, there's treasure in this area. So let's look for the treasure. We must get the treasure. We must 100%. We must see every corner of the game, if at all possible. <laughs> I'll probably miss some secrets through the game, like some hidden areas. Oh, 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 new enemy, new enemy, this is a swirl. And yeah, it does that, basically. <laughs> it's not all that uh, big big of a deal, and yeah. In fact, all the enemies in the early game aren't that big of a deal overall. And there's the treasure chest. I got the mysterious journal. So that means we don't know who it's written by. I'm terribly worried. My memory seems to be a blank slate. Who are these people chasing me? When I try to remember anything, my head throbs terribly. I must remember. Well, it's clearly made by the bunny. But we don't know his name just yet. Now do we? We might figure that out later on. Or maybe we won't. Maybe we'll never finish this walkthrough. Okay, we'll finish this walkthrough. <laughs> That's... I finished many walkthroughs so far, I don't think I'll be quitting anytime soon. <laughs> and let's see what's around the bend here. There's not really anything to explore if I go up that way. Anything inside the seaweed? No. No, I said seaweed, not seaweed. There's a there's a big difference there. <laughs> Stop jumping at me. You guys are not hard as long as I just keep charging at you. And with that comes the end of the level. And that's another one 100%ed, I think. So with that, I think it's a good time to end off the part. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.